हेलो एंड वेलकम टू दिस एडिशन ऑफ कैंपस वॉक्स टुडे वी आर इन द सिटी ऑफ अहमदाबाद नोन फॉर इट्स वर्ल्ड क्लास एकेडमिक एंड रिसर्च इंस्टीट्यूशंस रेंजिंग फ्रॉम द फेबल्ड इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ मैनेजमेंट टू द नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ डिजाइन टू द अप सर्जिंग इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी गांधीनगर द साइंटिफिक एंड टेक्नोलॉजिकल फर्वर इंड्यूस्ड by the legendary vikram sarabhai the father of the indian space program still thrives in the nerves of these academic and research institutions i am standing opposite to the gujarat science city in at the entrance of the sal institute of technology and engineering research founded by a metallurgical engineer rajendra bhai shah who was to be a first generation entrepreneur establishing the flagship shah alloys limited the institution is making its stride on the innovation curve sal institute of technology and engineering research has a distinctive direction for innovation the institution envisions to have a significant international impact with a strong local commitment today we have with us dr rupesh vasani he is a noted academician and an inspirational administrator dr vasani has had a long stint of 20 years at the gujarat technological university he has overseen the establishment and uh, development of the hundreds of engineering institutions across the state he has been with the sal institute of technology and engineering research right from its inception just 5 years the immaculate leadership exhibited by him has uh, enabled sal to have a space in the limca book of records uh, by creating the first robo lab and also the feat of having 120 patents filed in a single day i welcome you sir so what is the distinctive purpose of naming this institution as sal institute of technology and engineering research it's uh, initiated by one of the technocrat mr rajendra bhai shah who himself is a metallurgical engineer so sal it stands for shah alloys limited so the first initiation was shah alloys limited it's a alloy steel factory the second initiation of the same group it was hospital so it's a sal hospital the name has been given and the third feather in uh, sal cap it's a sal institute of technology and engineering research so sal stands for shah alloys limited so uh, the very purpose of uh, putting the name uh, the suffix as engineering research uh, shows a lot of commitment uh, where the institution is focused towards how would you like to uh, comment on this uh, we have already proved within a short time uh it's itself shows can not the development of the student as an a simple conventional engineer but with the toppings of research or, or research also so we have already done the same and then institute comes a later first comes the research so that's why it has been engineering research